While Ariana Grande has not yet spoken out on her reported split from Dalton Gomez, she seems to be subtly signaling a new chapter on social media. After news broke this week that the position songstress and her husband of more than two years had reportedly gone their separate ways, eagle-eyed fans noticed that Ari appeared to have deleted photos of their wedding day from her Instagram grid. The pop star had previously shared romantic snaps from the special occasion, which took place at her Montecito home back in 2021. As of Wednesday, a few photos of Dalton remain live on Ariana's account, including a sweet selfie of the wicked actress resting her head on his that she posted last November. News of Ariana's post-removal comes days after TMZ reported that the married pair quietly separated in January and are, quote, heading toward divorce. A source told People magazine that the two parted earlier this year and have since, quote, been quietly and lovingly working on their friendship. A source told Us Weekly of their relationship. Things have been going really well for Ariana and Dalton since they got married. But unfortunately, they hit a rough patch a few months ago and haven't been able to recover. Access Hollywood has reached out to reps for Ariana for comment on the reported split. Ariana and Dalton were first romantically linked in early 2020 and announced their engagement in December of that year. They tied the knot the following spring and celebrated their second wedding anniversary this past May. Ariana commemorated the milestone on her Instagram stories at the time, sharing a throwback pic from their nuptials and writing in part, I love him so. Reports of a split between the Thank You Next singer and the real estate broker came one day after Ariana attended the Wimbledon final and noticeably did not wear her wedding ring, sparking speculation about her relationship status. She sat next to Andrew Garfield, as well as Jonathan Bailey, who she's starring alongside in the film adaptation of the musical Wicked. Ariana has been busy filming the movie for months now, though production was shut down last week due to the actor's strike. Back in April, she announced they were halfway done filming and reflected on how the process of making the movie was transformative. She wrote in part on Instagram, I am so grateful, I don't know what to do or say. To be here in Oz where every day is a life-changing one. To be feeling, learning, and growing so much at such a disarming speed. To feel so much love around me, to begin each day before the sun is up and to end after it sets. To hold my brilliant twin flame slash sister, Cynthia Arrivo's beautiful green hands every day. To work in the safest, most beautiful and loving, biggest yet most intimate slash tiny feeling spaces. To be led by the most thoughtful, brilliant, compassionate and warmest possible director on this planet, my other Aussie and best friend ever, John M. Chu. To be transforming and healing parts of me that I never knew needed it, or maybe did. When news broke that Ariana had been cast in Wicked, she was starring on The Voice as a coach alongside Kelly Clarkson, John Legend, and Blake Shelton. During her season, she told Access Hollywood how much she adored working with the music legends. I have said it a million times, but I just love everyone that I've been able to work with here so much. I love everyone sitting here so much. We've had the best time, and um, I feel honored to learn from them and to watch them coach, and I just feel like so blessed to be here and spend time with everybody. Everyone's so nice. We have so much fun. I know we do our little shtick on the show, mm -hmm. but I really do love everyone so much. Yeah. So I, love much you. I love you too. We love you too.